What's up, fellow workers, comrades, beer comrades, beer connoisseurs, beer not connoisseurs, whatever you are. This is Belgium, New Belgium, Fat Tire Belgium White. Now, this is different than their regular Fat Tire offering, which is a beer that I enjoy quite a bit and have not reviewed on here yet. I picked up um, a winter 12-pack, sampler pack or whatever, of the New Belgium offerings. Um, so I'll be trying them out over the next couple of days on here, try to get more into a groove. I'm a teacher, I've just started my winter break, so I'll be posting more stuff. Now, according to this description, this is our Belgium Master Brew Classics White Wheat Ale brewed with Seville orange peel and freshly ground coriander. So it's a, a take on their Belgium white, but I mean, I know, I know that their regular fat tire offering is not a white uh, Belgium white, so I don't know. Anyways, uh, look at it, it's very, very hazy. Little decent head that's sticking around. I'm using my minor beer glass today, not my usual IWW beer glass. Um, I want to give a shout out to Working Class History. They are a Facebook page, website, and podcast. Please check them out. They do really interesting work um, showing the history of the working class, all our struggles to get to the point we are today, um, and also reminding us of where we need to go. Um, anyways, take a sniff. So I had this beer once before. You can smell the coriander, you can smell the orange peel for sure right off the top. But it's also got like kind of a crisp pilsnery like uh, little hop smell like for like a hopped pilsner. That's kind of what I'm getting right now. I'm not getting so much of that uh, that white ale like typical like belt or uh, blue moon style like that you that is the more typical right. Um, the coriander is a little bit subtle. It's kind of like a herbally but crisp. It's like a mix of like, I don't know, I'm not being very specific, but it smells pretty good. Um, ooh, I want to get this done in three minutes, so let's go for it. Mm. Interesting. So I've had other beers with coriander in it, and I usually don't like them. Um, I think it overpowers the beer. But this is mixed in really subtly. I feel like it's good for just one. I couldn't drink this all night for sure. Um, the orange peel is there. Let me see what else I'm getting. Hmm. Interesting. It's a super refreshing beer with a lot going on. Everything is pretty even keeled, like nothing overpowers the other. None of the tastes are like too extreme. The coriander is not too extreme. The orange peel is not too extreme. Um, you can see how it's a white ale in its essence. It kind of reminds me of Hitachino a little bit, um, of their white ale, uh, but not as spicy or as flavorful. Um, and that's a beer that I love. Oh yeah, the ABV on this is six or 5.2, um, which is pretty good. Uh, I wish I had some fat tire to review next to this to kind of compare the regular fat tire. But um, let me take another sip. I'm going to stop right at 3.30, okay? Yeah. This is really solid. It's a unique tasting beer for me. Not super well-versed. I'm going to give it a 3.75 out of 5. All right. Workers of the World Unite. Solidity forever. An injury to one is an injury to all. Peace.